What is classical test theory? In the context of psychometric assessments, classical test theory is the underlying theoretical framework for standardized testing. The way it works is it posits that a person's observed score, what they actually scored on any particular psychometric assessment, is underpinned by two things. First, their true score, which is their genuine level of ability or standing on a particular trait. Additionally, level of error is likely to influence that observed score. Naturally, no single assessment is ever completely reliable. And as a result, there's always going to be a random level of error associated with that measurement. It's used ultimately with the goal of minimizing the error component and therefore ensuring maximum congruence between the observed score and the theoretical true score. Now, for a practical example, imagine a candidate's completing a numerical reasoning assessment and they get 16 out of 20. That is the observed score. That's the score that they actually got on the assessment. It's unknowable, but the true score, let's say, that this, this particular candidate is actually very skilled in numerical reasoning and they should have gotten 18 out of 20, but they didn't because of the error component associated with that assessment. As a result, we try to increase the reliability of the assessment, minimizing the level of error. Now, although classical test theory is very well established and very commonly used, item response theory, also known as modern psychometric test theory, is increasingly supplanting it.